I'm James Wright and welcome to my shop. The Hand Tool Build Off 2016 is drawing to a close and I just want to take a time to show all of the entries that have come in and uh, wow, I have been absolutely blown away by all of the entries and um, the, the, the quality and skills that I've seen and some really fascinating ideas on how to make them. And so uh, really a huge thank you to everyone who has participated in this. Uh, basically what we're going to be doing is of all of the entries who have come in, um, I and uh, my friend uh, John are going to actually be going through and uh, choosing uh, two winners. Um, so for the first place prize we have a Stanley 45. This is absolutely in amazing condition uh, with a full set of irons and uh, the original box for it. And uh, yeah, I have to say a huge thank you to uh, John for offering this up. This is just uh, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, someone's going to be really happy. So that'll be the first place prize. The second place prize is for the uh, smoothing plane that I made a while back. Uh, this is an ash body with a purple heart sole and a quarter inch iron. Um, it's a lot of fun to use and, and takes a really fine shaving if you tune it up right. So someone's going to really enjoy that and uh, I'm going to be sad to see it go. But uh, some of the entries we got in. Rob's Workshop made a square and panel gauge. Uh, really well done. One of these days I need to make a panel gauge. I'm um, just really liking these. These will be a prize offered to viewers in the EU. Donnie Carter made two knives. And as I have these in my shop, these are actually offered for anyone in the world. And uh, someone's going to be really happy. It's a really nice pair. I'm looking forward to uh, handing those out. Justin made two marking gauges, one of them a marking gauge and the other one is a, uh, a tenon gauge and so you can actually, or a mortising gauge, so that you can mark out the two sides. Really cool pair. These are offered to EU viewers. The Woodworking Junkie, Alan, my friend in Canada, made a marking gauge, a cool design. Uh, this is actually something that's going to be offered for uh, Canadian viewers. GP Woodworks is the first person to uh, complete the project, um, so a huge thank you to you. This is a fantastic router plane and it will be offered to uh, viewers in the US. Barry Cox from BC Design made this mallet with a really, really cool striped veneer inlay. Um, beautiful, beautiful job. This will be offered to uh, viewers in uh, Europe. Tip 70 made a knife with a sheaf. This is really, really kind of cool. And this will also be one that is um, offered to anyone in the world. So anyone in the world can win this knife. Not Only Wood made a mallet, uh, <laughs> really kind of a sweet design, um, carved out of a single piece of wood on the lathe. Beautiful mallet. This will be to uh, European viewers. Wayne Cole, um, a viewer from down in Texas, made this entire toolkit with a uh, sanding block and uh, clamps and all sorts of goodies. I just, uh, a really nice set and someone is going to get a, a whole group of tools with this. This is offered to anyone in the US. Opa from Opa's Workshop, a good friend of mine from a uh, little while south of me, he made a, a center finder and marking gauge. This is a really nice little uh, setup and uh, just gorgeous, gorgeous work. Um, I love the, uh, the the metal inlay on it. Well done. So this will be a, uh, a prize for uh, U.S. viewers. Black Widow Woodworks um, is making an awl, and it's a really sharp little awl. Uh, he's also going to be throwing in a, another prize going along with it. So I'm looking forward to giving that out, and you won't know until it arrives. This will be for uh, viewers in the U.S. Mark Pennell made a set of router planes. These are gorgeous. He did a fantastic job on them, and uh, he lives about an hour away from me, and one of these days I need to get it together with him and say, hey, uh, these are for viewers in the U.S. Know what mom knows. Um, she is a, a great gal and uh, did some things that I've never seen before. Amazingly resourceful. This is just a, a cool little tool. Um, great looking. And uh, someone's going to be happy with this little booger. And uh, this will be to uh, anyone in the world. It is uh, small enough I can ship out. So anyone in the world can get this. Shane's Hobby Shop made this mallet, and the handle on it is just a really cool design with uh, 45 degree cuts. Um, well, well done. Uh, metal cap on one end. This will be a, a great addition to anyone's shop. This is for people in the U.S. 
Daniel Slawi, I'm sorry if I got your name wrong, I am horrible with pronouncing them, he made this brace that is absolutely gorgeous. Now, if you've ever tried to make a brace, it is actually a very difficult thing to do. You have to make it square, you have to make it true, and uh, very well done. Um, this is uh, absolutely gorgeous, and this is actually just for uh, viewers in Argentina. And so if you are viewing in Argentina, uh, you have a very high chance of winning this, as I think there's only like, what, 10 or so people viewing down there. So keep an eye out, you might be able to win this brace. Miller's Woods, um, a good friend of mine who lives about uh, 10 miles away from here, he made this mallet set, and one's a little smaller, one's a little larger, um, beautiful out of uh, oak and black walnut, um, and just beautiful, beautiful job, and uh, these are going to be fun. These are for U.S. viewers. Last, we have Wood Tools Workshop. He made this compass and marking gauge that are, it's really kind of a cool combination with a, uh, a sliding dovetail. Really well done, and uh, this will be for people in the United States. So, wow, we got a lot of fun things to give away. So over the next couple days, John and I are going to be figuring out who gets to win these first two prizes, and that is going to be a very tough pick. Um, I, I don't know how we're going to be able to do it, and uh, so we're, we're going to have to try and figure out who gets to win them. Um, not an easy task. So we're going to be doing an announcement probably uh, Saturday, maybe Sunday, um, about who actually won these two prizes. And on that video, we will explain how uh, you as a, uh, a viewer can win one of these other tools that have been made by uh, makers all across the world. And so we're going to be shipping out these tools to makers everywhere. And it's going to be a really fun time. So I really encourage you, um, click in the description below. I have a list of all of the, uh, the people who have made tools. Um, if they made a video to go along with it, you can actually see the video about how they made it. Um, great chance to, to see a lot of different ideas and how to make things. I've just been blown away by this whole process, and uh, it's going to be very cool. So I hope you like this. Um, please let me know in the comments below who do you think should win. What was, your favorite pro what was your favorite prize? What was your favorite idea? I'd love to hear about it. If you like the video, please hit like and think about subscribing. And until next time, have a wonderful day.